Gaining the ability to play old Game Boy Advance games on my Galaxy Z Flip 3 is probably one of the coolest things I've done on this phone. So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to install that emulator and how to play old games on your Galaxy Z Flip 3. So let's get right into it. All right, so we're going to have to download the emulator first. So we're just going to go to the Play Store here, go to the search and search up My Boy Light. And it should be the first uh, result there, My Boy Light. They also have a paid version, but the free one will work just fine. So get that downloaded and we'll move on to the next step. As to where to get the ROMs, I would just say, just do a Google search, but I'll also leave a comment in the comment section of the latest one that I found. Um, because, you know, these websites, you tend to get taken down every now and then. So yeah, just find, find a ROM and then move on to the next step. So once you got your ROMs from like a fictional website called freeroms.com or something along those lines, my suggestion is to save that ROM to like a cloud site like Google Drive and then download it from your Google Drive. Because from my experience, when I'm downloading it through my phone, it takes a really long time for some reason. So what I did was I downloaded it on my laptop and put it on my drive and then access my drives through my phone and download it that way. And that was the fastest way. So that's my suggestion on how to do it. So let's actually open the ROM and get it up and running. So once you have your ROMs on your phone, whether you downloaded it through a browser or you downloaded it from like Google Drive or any kind of other cloud um, service, you're gonna want to create a folder for it. So you're gonna go to My Files, which is an app here on your Z Flip, right here, My Files. You're gonna open it and then you're gonna create a folder for those ROMs, so it's all always in one place. So what I did was I opened up internal storage, I went to DCIM, and I created a folder here called ROMs. To create a folder, you're gonna click those three dots in the top right and hit create folder. So just name it and then hit create. I already have it open, so uh, I created the folder here called ROMs, and basically you're gonna want to transfer the ROM you downloaded, and most likely it'll be in your downloads folder, but if not, try to track it down, um, but it most likely be in your downloads folder. So you're gonna open up your downloads folder and basically move it all the way over there. Um, how basically you do it is you click the file, I'll just take this random file here, and you're gonna hit move, just like that, and you're basically you're gonna go to the location where you save that folder. In my case, I've put in DCIM, and here's ROMs, and here it is here, and you're gonna move it here transfer it there and now all your ROMs will be in one folder, easy to find. So you're gonna take that that path you made, basically where you stored this ROMs folder, which is in my case DCIM, um, and there's it, there it is, and it's in my internal storage. And from here we're going to open up my boy free. So from here, right, you're gonna have to find it. Um, in this case I already had it open. Uh, for me, I have it in DCIM. And here it is at ROMs. And then right here, I have I currently have Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. I played this a long time ago, but I haven't beaten it yet. So I'm gonna open it up by clicking it. And there you go, it's, it's open. And see, the controls are down here. Um, let's see, look at that, that is so cool. We're gonna press A. So yeah, and we are good to go. If you click this button right here, it gives you a whole bunch of different options here from loading your save game, saving your save game, fast forwarding, I, I believe that's only available in the paid version, cheats, settings, you can link your remote, uh, screenshot, reset. In settings, you just have a whole bunch of different stuff in here. I've just got this, so there's a lot I don't know yet, but this is insane. So this is a, like your start button down here. And look at that, that is so cool. And then see, you can bend the phone like that and play it basically like a Game Boy <laughs> if you really wanted to, just like that. That's pretty fire. So, really, really cool. If this video helped you, make sure you hit that like button. It really helps a lot and pushes this video to all the different people who might want to be playing like Game Boy Advance games on their Z Flip 3. If you guys want to hear my full on review on the Z Flip 3, click top link and the before you buy in the bottom link. But thank you guys so much for watching again. I'll see you guys in the next one.